Member Statements. Member Primarily Gormal. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, today, uh, Prime Minister Modi is in Canada and meeting with Prime Minister Harper and Premier Wynn. While it is important to discuss opportunities to strengthen bilateral trade and to expand investments, our governments must also address concerns raised by Canadians regarding years of escalating attacks on religious minorities, including Christians, Muslims and Sikhs, as well as the extremely concerning incidents of violence against women in India. Under Modi's government, the acts of state violence against Sikhs in 1984 have been referred to as a genocide. But now this government must take the next steps to ensure that those responsible are brought to justice. In India, attacks on religious institutions continue to occur, as well as acts of fear and intimidation against Christians, Muslims, and other minority religions. It is important for leaders to clearly state that all people have the right to practice their faith, how they choose, and to do so free from persecution and fear. It is particularly important to clearly denounce violence against women and to enact policies to address this pernicious epidemic. It is our obligation as a democratic state to protect universal human rights of all people and to denounce a practice of targeting people based on heritage, beliefs, or gender. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.